guys. How you guys doing? I missed you all. <laughs> Where's Jim? Hi, Casey. I have a few things to say to you, obviously. Um, you know, it's, it's funny that I never intentionally did anything to hurt you. When Lee and I got together, he told me that he really, really liked me in that way and always confessed that he didn't like you in that way. He liked you as a friend. And as soon as I left, you found it, you know, prime opportunity to th completely throw yourself at him. And it's, it's quite embarrassing, actually, how you've done that because he did express that he really liked me. So you intentionally and deliberately went out to hurt me. I've been having to sit at home and watch this every day as you throw it in my face. And I know that you thought I threw it in your face, but it was a lot different. You saw us together. You knew what was going on. But yet, as soon as I left, oh, Lee, do you want to Oh, Lee. I've seen everything. Putting your on his face and saying how horny you are and how you woke up so horny and how, you know, please cuddle me and I can't wait to have sex you do when I get out of here. Just a lot of like really intentionally hurtful things. And as a girl's girl that you claim you are, I just want to let you know how embarrassing you've looked and how really, really bad you've come across to everyone. And it's looked extremely desperate and Everyone's labeling you as a bunny boiler. I don't even know what that term means coming from America because I don't know what that means, but that's what they're saying you are. And it's really turned against you in your favor, which is unfortunate and sad.